The first eight pound pint has been served in an unnamed London pub this year, according to the Financial Times. They say the average price of a pint has gone up 70% since 2008. And it's expected that this price will rise even more with the recession looming over our heads. But is it a must to raise prices for all hospitality venues? It's, in the past few weeks, it's definitely, definitely a change in the atmosphere in the pub and how often people are. Obviously, regulars are a big part here, but so we've seen their numbers dwindle here and there. And so the amount they're spending and time they're spending in the pub is, is, is all overall on the decrease. And moving into the winter months, I think it's really only going to get worse. And how do you feel about the news of an eight pound pint? Because I view the eight pound pint as quite a statement, actually. And so when people see that statement, that's, to me, going to not only stop them drinking in pubs in general, but reduce the amount they go out to sort of social venues and stuff, because they're thinking, well, if it's eight pounds there, they can stamp and let stamp in with that. And nobody's wanting to go 30, 40 minutes for a pint. Down at the local pub, if that's what it's becoming, then it's going to be real few, real few dark months ahead. What do Londoners expect to pay for a pint? Is eight pounds too much? say I probably expect to pay around between six and seven, six-ish. I don't agree with necessarily like to be but it's not necessarily hospitality's fault. It's a lot of supplies go up, other things go up, eventually prices rise. I think it's just inevitable. Well, where I'm, norm where I'm normally from, I expect to spend about five, five fifty on a pint. Yeah. Spending eight pounds on a pint. Once you've had a few, it racks up quite easily. If you've normally paid about five quid, and it's three pound every time, it's going to cost you probably an extra thirty quid in night out. So yeah, I wouldn't want to. So, what are your views on the future of hospitality? I don't necessarily know where the positives are going to come in. I like to think there are some, definitely. But we are quite strong as a nation, and we're quite proud, and we I mean, have our culture. And I think that's maybe one of the factors that will sort of be the shining light for the industry of social social outings. Recent events have forced pubs to up their prices. They do still keep their doors open with their hope for a safe British drinking culture. It's just a trip to the pub might have to be a little more of a luxury, the £8 pint in London being a staple.